Hey guys, this is Joel. You're watching my podcast, Party Like a Rockstar. I just had the opportunity, and it was an opportunity, to watch a video called Oran by Nomophila. This is actually from the same show. The song is Dissension. Oran was so awesome, I wanted to jump into this one too. Because I figured, hey man, that was awesome, so this one's got to be pretty good, right? They obviously were on that day. <laughs> so let's give it a go together. If you haven't watched any of my podcasts, you do not know who I am. You did not watch Oran and you don't know what's going on. I'm an ex-roadie. I used to tour with bands like Guns N' Roses, Stone Temple Pilots, Poison, and The Cranberries. I wrote a book called Memo of a Roadie. It was the number one new release on Amazon and Bios. It's done three million copies on Kindle. It's been a lot of fun. It's been a lot, a lot of fun. I also have a Patreon now, too. You can join it for as little as one dollar. And you can let me know songs you think I should react to. I'll do my best to do so. Let's jump into this, guys. Dissension, Nemophila, live. Dissension! That was such a dramatic transition there. I totally did not expect that. I'm also wondering who headlined this festival. I do not believe they're the headliners. There's saran wrap over everything. So it's either raining, which I don't believe it is, or uh, they're protecting it for somebody else who gets water and crap all over the place. So it might be fun to know. Anyway, let's get into it. <laughs> It is raining. That's why there's specs, I think, on the lens. So that's all it was. Uh, I hate the editor again, but we talked about that in the last video. So quit editing so much, dude, and let us watch a performance. But killer song, right? <laughs>
here comes Shine Nemo Fila will rock. <laughs> Great song, totally dug it. That was fun. This must have been a really good show, dude. Partying like that in the rain, listening to these girls must have been awesome. <laughs> yeah, I said I think they weren't headlining because it looks like there's more backline behind them, which makes me think there was another band coming on after them. How we usually do it is we, we set the line up and then you have the next nine and the next nine. So by the end of the night, you have the headliner and the stage is empty for the headliner to get around and stuff like that. So it's hard to tell with the editing because they're so quick, but it looked like there was more backline behind those amps and stuff. Although she was using a drum kit that looked like maybe they'd have to tear it down and put another drum kit. So anyway, I don't know, maybe two in the weeds, but that's why I brought that up. That's what I was going on in my head. I look forward to seeing you guys on the next one. Thank you. <laughs> Hey guys, I hope you enjoyed the show. I now have a Twitter, Instagram, TikTok, Discord, and even a Patreon. The Patreon you can join for as little as one buck. The handle on all of them, it's of course, Joel Rody. I'll see you guys on the next one.